FedEx, UPS, and the Postal Service working feverishly to deliver millions of packages this holiday season, and now a new contender is emerging to try to take a piece of that business. Frank Holland is delivering the goods at a DHL facility in New Jersey. Hey, Frank. Uh, hey. hey, guys. You know, the holiday shipping season is in full swing here at DHL's brand new automated facility where they're focusing on mid-sized online-only retailers and, of course, their shipments like this one. DHL says this automation that you're looking at allows them to process 40,000 shipments per hour. To put that in perspective, that's 60 percent more than at a non-automated facility like the one in nearby Newark. However, DHL is not trying to get into the home delivery e-commerce commerce market. That's already dominated by the USPS, UPS, and FedEx. They control about 95 percent. Instead, retailers bring their goods here. DHL then flies them to a post office close to the buyer. Your mailman handles what's called the last mile of delivery. CEO Lee Spratt says that strategy and this automation is all about responding to the tightening labor market. On Monday, uh, Cyber Monday, we had a forecast for this building that we'd have about 200,000 pieces in here. What we actually got was 300,000 pieces. For us to be able to rapidly respond and go find additional people to bring them into the building, that would have been almost impossible to do. And DHL and many other companies are trying to respond to that tightening labor market. To put that in perspective, this same unit 10 years ago, 90% of what they handled were envelopes and packages like catalogs. Now, 90% are parcels and packages from e-commerce. So definitely a changing situation for any company in the e-commerce business. Melissa, back over to you. All right, Frank. Thanks. Frank Holland at DHL.